Hey, what's up guys? I am super excited. It's Friday, Labor Day weekend, and this is usually one of the busiest times in the fall for, or into summer for our team. Last year we set a record ratified contracts during this week, so hoping to break that record this year. And this Daily Dose though, I want to talk about building for your vision, right? You need to hire, you need to plan, not for where you are right now, but where you are going for your vision. So this week we started moving people down to our first floor office, which was under renovation. And then in about a month, maybe maybe a month and a half, we will be moving people up to about 10,000 new square feet on the 10th floor. And it's gonna be awesome, it's gonna be super spacious. We're a little crammed in our office right now and have been for the last couple of years. We've been kind of chasing smaller spaces and, and, and just, you know, staying uh, on top of what we need, but but always feeling a little, little behind. And then like once we, we get new space that, man, we, we've almost outgrown it already. So this time we, we, we went bigger. We're gonna have a lot more room. You know, we've got about 85 people on the team now, agents and support staff, but I imagine we'll break 100 by the end of the year because we are generating a ton of leads, hiring, growing more, and the space we're getting now, combined with our first floor space, we could handle up to 150. So it's a space we can grow into for a while. And I think a lot of people in real estate, they hire for where they are now, and then when the growth comes, they're behind. Right, if you, if you, if you, you know, and I know we're a big team, but even if you're just a small, uh, smaller team or a solo agent starting out, a lot of times people will will wait till they till they needed an assistant like yesterday before they hire their first assistant, and then you're scrambling, you you're busy, you're dropping balls with your clients, you don't have time to generate enough qualified applicants. You start making compromises on your standards and you bring that person on and then you do not give have the time to give them the training so they don't work out and the cycle repeats itself. So you gotta hire before the need is there. Hire for where you are going. That's my message today. Hopefully that helps. Hopefully it resonates. If it did, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button too, by the way, and turn on post notifications so you don't miss our podcast and all of our amazing stuff that we've got going on on this YouTube channel uh, or wherever you're watching. And please share this with some other people. I want to help as many real estate agents as I can. I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up, hit that like button, leave us some comments. We want to know your feedback and share this with someone that you think could benefit as well. And if you want to see more great videos, click this playlist up here or better yet, click right here to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of our updates.